Uh, Seth Carpenter, Morgan Stanley Chief Global Economist, is with us now to talk about the global goings on and, and the economic picture right now. Goings on. Strange, unusual, humorous, or unsuitable events or activities. There were some strange goings on in that hospital. Um, it feels sort of like we're on a precipice globally, but it's not sort of a sharp precipice, right? Precipice is a very steep side of a cliff or a mountain. If you say that someone is on the edge of a precipice, you mean that they are in a dangerous situation in which they are extremely close to disaster or failure. There is a climber dangling from the precipice. The banks brought the economy to the edge of a precipice. I mean, how are you thinking about the big picture right now? I think right now, uh, less of a precipice, more the tide is going out. I think mm. there is, there had been for, for months now sort of these storm clouds of recession looming. Loom. If an unwanted or unpleasant event looms, it seems likely to happen soon and causes worry. The inevitable species war looming. Our country's brightest leaders have come together, debate and reason with the ambassador of cats. But for the undefeated best pound for pound boxer in the world, the future is filled with uncertainty, with a seven year prison sentence looming. I didn't plan on spending me prime years in a prison cell. And now is the time where I think the, the storm is really coming. If you think about the three key economies, the US, Europe, and China, um, not a great story on the outlook anywhere. Europe, we think, will still go into recession. We're, we're pretty pessimistic there. High energy prices. Pessimistic. Thinking that bad things are more likely to happen or emphasizing the bad part of a situation. Optimistic. Hoping or believing that good things will happen in the future. Someone who is optimistic is hopeful about the future or the success of something in particular. Music changed my outlook from pessimistic to optimistic and brightened my day. Uh, high food prices have hurt the consumer and we think things are going down and the ECB is just laser focused on headline inflation so they're hiking. Laser focus. Give 100% of your attention to a single object. A legacy is not something that I can be concerned with. I'm, I'm laser focused on doing the best possible job I can as president of the... Catherine. Do I need Santiago laser focused on this proposal. We can tell her after we turn the reporting. China, they averted, they ended the contraction they had in Q2, but things have not really started to rebound. The housing sector is imploding. Implode. If something implodes, it collapses into itself in a sudden and violent way. If something such as an organization or a system implodes, it suddenly ends completely because it cannot deal with the problems it is experiencing. An economy implodes. An industry implodes. A market implodes. The economy of the country is in danger of imploding. They still have strong COVID restrictions. It's going to be hard for them to get any traction, we think, by the end of this year and probably not even into Q2 of next year. So uh, really weak growth, something with a two handle for China for this year, which is, you know, pretty dismal. Dismal. 
something that is dismal, is bad, or in a sad, depressing way. The talk was a dismal failure. What a dismal day. Which leaves us the U.S. where we are guardedly optimistic, we don't think. Guardedly. Cautiously. In a way that is careful not to give too much information or show how you really feel. He says he is guardedly optimistic about the reforms. Asked if he has a girlfriend, James guardedly responds, I like to keep my private life private. There's a recession on the horizon for the U.S., but it's pretty clear. Chair Powell spoke yesterday. He spoke at Jackson Hole. They are trying to slow the U.S. economy down a lot. How you can avoid a recession, no outright contraction, no sort of mass layoffs. Outright, as an adjective, means complete. There was no outright winner in the war. As an adverb, means directly or immediately instead of in stages. You should tell him outright that he is making a mistake. Layoff is an occasion when a company stops employing someone, sometimes temporarily, because the company does not have enough money or enough work. But it's still not this happy picture of a booming economy. Booming. Growing or expanding very quickly. Making a deep and loud hollow sound. His business is booming at the moment. His car is fully equipped with a booming sound system. And, you know, once you have those three key economies going, it sort of sets the stage for the whole world.